Hello beautiful people, welcome back to the channel. It's your girl Z from GrowEasy.com Welcome back guys to all my OGs, my new subscribers. Welcome, welcome, welcome. I don't take it for granted. Thank you very much. If you're new here, kindly subscribe so you can help us grow and then also hit the like button and the notification bell so you're notified whenever we post videos like this. Today I said we're creating the cover page for our puzzle book that we created okay this is the part two of that video and we're going to be using free tools as well okay so if you go to uh, google just type cover calculator kdp it's going to bring out this for you where you can calculate your uh, cover page the dimension in inches all right and it's, it shows you if you're using bleed or non-bleed okay so if you if you don't know how to create uh, a word puzzle search we use chat dpt in the last video so go down to the description button i'm going to leave a thumbnail up here where you can uh click on it and go check it out so this is a, a kdp uh, cover calculator and template you can also use bookow it's also very straightforward but bookow will always need your email all right so uh, but today i'm just going to use the amazon kdp calculator so i'll just come here and select paper bag because we're going to be printing on paper bag select black and white which is your interior uh, for, um, paper type we want uh, white okay page turn left to right then uh, measurement it's an in inches click on inches interior is a 8 by 8.5 by 11 inches file so how many number of pages do you want I want 60 okay so let's go to calculate dimension and then you have an option to download your dimension after KDP has calculated your dimension for you so this is our Amazon KDP calculator. It just calculated it for us, and then you can see full cover 17.385, and then the inches is 11 by 25 because it's it has a bleed. Okay, you can actually hover through so you know what exactly it means. Okay, so I love my to be bleed because uh, my my graphics usually run to the side so they can have uh, some spaces to trim. All right, no bleed means uh, you don't want it to run to the side. Okay, so maybe I'll just do a video on that explaining the margins and all of that so i'll just come here and i dilute my template it will come down and then we can start using so we'll go back to canva now and impute those things that we already have so we'll come to here and come to customize okay here remember is a 17.385 let's be sure let's go here and find out yeah 17.385 okay then here is 11.25 okay the bleed margin then you simply click on create template okay so guys this is our canva um, board that we're going to be working on so the first thing i love to do i love to bring out go to your upload and bring upload that template you just downloaded the cover page that the cover page calculator you just downloaded i just did mine now so i'll go to element and i'm going to put some um, a rectangular shape a blank rectangle i'll just put something blank so i'll lock i'll lock that down so it doesn't move okay so i'll just move this here and i'll expand i'll just make it feel everywhere up so uh don't 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 bother about the color yet all right because uh your cost when you when you're done customizing you can actually decide what color you want to go with in particular okay so i'll just take this backward all right so i'll go back to element again and then okay so i'm seeing some very nice uh, fonts i want to use so i'll just bring this one out here okay so those of you who want to do valentine theme this is nice i am actually doing a valentine theme though it's not a valentine book but since it's a season of valentine come on doesn't hurt to do this okay so i'll just do this then i'll duplicate this and i'll put it on the other side okay because I want this thing to be I'll just flip it yeah so I want it to be like that. okay this works for me so we can remove uh, this see where I'm clicking on we can remove the template now just click across and unlock it then you can actually delete it off okay so now we can actually change this color 
by going to the color wheel and picking a color that we have on the body of this thing any color from there works oh sorry okay so voila if it's too dark simply go back I've talked about that and then find something else that works for you so I think this works for me so I'll just move this a little bit okay so I'll lock this thing down so it doesn't move on me you know we're using two different uh, abstract shape here so I'll lock it down so it doesn't move on me so this is what we have here okay so we'll start customizing in here I'll just go now to my upload and then I'll bring out one of those um, word search solution and just simply shape it and bring it here go to text it will start coming out in a while okay positive Guys, uh, if you haven't seen the video we created while when we were creating the puzzle itself, uh, the link is in the description box and I'll leave uh, a thumbnail so you can know what to search for. Go watch it, okay? People are making money in ChatGPT. I am making money with ChatGPT. Okay, so go ahead and check it. I'll bring out this other one as well. I want to just simply write word search here. So please. If you're not subscribed and you are still here, kindly do so. I don't know what you're waiting for, okay? Help this girl to grow, alright? Okay, because I'm going to be sharing some very nice contents uh, on how we can actually grow in this year and maximize ourselves. So I'll make this one, just change the font a little, okay? Alright, so positive by. I think I'll just change the color of this one and um, maybe do something pinkish. I go back to element and then this is not totally showing so I want to put it on something just something to hold it for me okay make this bigger and then have this sit on it let's bring this down a little bit okay then I, I will just um, okay like I said before, always lock your background. I didn't do that. You saw it moved. So I'll just group this one. So I can move them as a unit. And I'll bring it here. So uh, I'm going to just put in a little inscription for adults. So I'll go to element um, text and get that uh, body text. And I'll just write seniors, okay? Put a hyphen here and just expand it. And we can put another text down here and just put large print. It's important that your buyers get to see these things. Okay, that will prompt them to actually uh, want to buy. Let me just bring back my template so we'll get to see if we are on track. <laughs> okay, go to upload again and then just pick your template and put it up here so you know exactly where you need to make some adjustments consigning the print else uh, KDP will reject your work okay they'll tell you to go fix it if it crosses the borders so you see why exactly on point and it's actually uh, centralized over here okay so uh, so guys this is how our word puzzle search cover page looks like so what what i usually like to do i come to this back side i don't like to leave it plain i'll just add um, some text to it okay like a, a little instruction so just do what works for you okay okay guys so this is our cover page and then we just simply go to download when we are satisfied uh, let me know in the comment section below what you think you can sell these things on Amazon, on Etsy, on Gumroad, any of your online stores, all right? Okay, so, and then don't forget to subscribe so you can follow me on our subsequent videos on. So until my next video, remember, I love you and keep growing. Bye-bye.